President Uhuru Kenyatta and Royal Media Services Chairman Dr. S.K. Masharia joined family, friends and dignitaries in a memorial service held at the All Saints Cathedral in Nairobi to honor Kenya's first Attorney General, Charles Jonjo. The ceremony was conducted privately as per the wishes of the family. Jonjo passed on in the early hours of January the 2nd and was cremated hours later according to his wishes. Alpha Slagat tells us more. At the All Saints Cathedral, Nairobi, the family of the late Sir Charles Njonjo gathered for a memorial service two weeks after the former post-independence attorney general passed on. The family gathered to celebrate the times and memories they shared with him. <laughs> President Uru Kenyatta and Royal Media Services Chairman Dr. S.K. Masharia joined the family, friends and other dignitaries for the private ceremony. All Saints Cathedral was crucial to Njonjo who was fondly referred to as Duke of Kabetesha, as it is here that he exchanged the vows of marriage. His family in the eulogy read during the memorial service described him as loving and forgiving. It read in part, Njonjo's fall from power when he resigned from his high-profile civil service job became a subject of presidential commission inquiry. That perhaps the most important thing to remember about this inquiry is how Charles was able to find forgiveness in his heart and build a new friendship with then president which remains strong and productive. End of quote. His family and true friends know that his intentions were and will always remain in the service of God and country. The family says that, quote, despite rigorous precautions, Charles contracted pneumonia towards the end of 2021. According to his wishes, there was no returning to the hospital and no artificial prolonging of his life. End of quote. He died peacefully in the early morning hours of January 2nd, 2022, and within hours he was cremated at a small private ceremony, according to his wishes. Alpha Slagat, Citizen TV, Nairobi.